Run this shit, baby. Touch my hair. When it's the feelings I wear. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Before we even start watching the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe because you know when we come up if you want to keep up this brown girl. So today I look a hot mess because I'm like waist training and stuff. So I have like a sports bra on and a shirt under. But, and my hair is a hot mess. But today we're going to be doing a slick bun tutorial. So, <coughs> the things I have are a gel. This is the cannabis saliva oil and black castor oil and olive oil one. Not expensive. We're going to need a white tooth comb. A dipping brush. A toothbrush that has hair in it. Great. Love that. Then we're gonna need a rat tail comb. And then I usually use scrunchies, so whichever scrunchie goes with your outfit of the day. I just dropped one, cool. So like, I have a whole bunch. So I use that and then um, to like make sure it's under secured, I use the black rubber bands, not rubber bands. Hair elastics, so yeah, and my mist spray. It looks dirty because there's like I had oil in it and the oil solidified so yeah so we're gonna just start off by like spraying all over our hair let me just tell you about like what happened today so I was chilling doing my thing waist training and shit and then this guy from Comcast comes I guess well, someone in the family canceled um Comcast cable or whatever right so I'm over here like okay who in the world is ringing the doorbell and so I go to the door he's like hi I'm here to take the boxes and I'm like oh what and so there's a box in my room and then there's a box in the living room I'm adding some oil right now this is like some olive oil I'm just adding it into my hair and my hair is already parted like somewhat because I had like freaking horrible ass cornrows in my head so yeah that was cute so and my roots are growing out love that so um we're just gonna do a diagonal part because I'm an adult virgin yeah girl actually this part is fine. I'm just gonna refine it or whatever. Cause like, damn sis. Like when I did my um originally like bleached the front of my hair, <coughs> it wasn't straight. But yeah, I'm just parting it. But um, so he had came in. It was like a quick ass process. Like it just happened. Like he came in. There was a cable box in the living room, and so I'm about to like spray it again and um, comb it out with the wide tooth comb. So yeah, I came in, took the cable box out of the. Oh yeah, and you're gonna need a soft bristle brush because I don't use a hard bristle brush because that hurts my head and it feels like it pulls out my hair. So I can take that and comb it out. But um, so he yeah, came in. I let him in to go and take the boxes out because I'm like, what the hell? And it's like, I open the door. See, kids never open the door because then you can't get away with stuff. So, I'm over here chilling, whatever. He's like, okay. He's being mad awkward. He sounds foreign. I Shut can see the that. Up. But he sounds foreign. So, I'm like, okay. He's a foreigner. Cool. He's going to be mad awkward. And I didn't realize, like, my boxers were sort of see-through. Your mom's a hoe! Uh and your girl is kind of thick. So, you can kind of see my ass. And I had a waist trainer. I have this waist trainer on that looks like some type of sexual device type shit. Or whatever. I'm going to use the hard brush today, too. So, you might need these, too. But, um... So I'm over here like looking like some freaking BDSM type person. 
and I go in my room and I have to show him where the other cable box is and like the Wi-Fi stuff and um, he has to stumble upon my tripod and my camera in my room Let's suspect as fuck having a tripod and a camera in your room like sis what are you doing so I'm about to take some of this and slather it let me see if I can come out some other than I'm gonna slather that on top but yeah he goes in there he's like oh you feel you take pictures huh on the bed insisting that I am a toy star I am a toy star I am a toy star so um I'm like wow he really just insisted that I'm a porn star and I didn't realize this till like after the fact and I'm like oh yeah 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 I take pictures I take pictures and he was like looking at me funny at the whole thing so I had to walk him out like I went in the bathroom because it's like I'm gonna give him his privacy to go do whatever he needs to do take out the stuff I took off my ring so I can get the gel. So I usually wear nails so I would get it from the other way and not like this because it would get under my nails but I can do it this way right now. So I let him take his time. It took like probably like three minutes or three seconds for him to like get everything off of the out of the room or whatever. So I'm about to leave some hair on the side. And um he leaves out and he looks mad like funny like he's looking at me funny like okay and then like this is when I realized like oh yeah my whole ass is probably like showing or whatever but it's not but it is because it's sort of see through and so I'm like okay so this guy has seen my ass um he asked me basically if I was a porn star and I said yes so great He's really about, and like my name's not on the cable stuff, but he probably thinks it is. So he's about to search up this make-believe name on probably like Pornhub or something. And it's not going to be me up there. And so it's like, wow, buddy, you really thought I was a porn star. So I'm taking, so after it's like combed out, it's easier for you to flatten it out. So I'm taking this Demon brush and like going over it. So it's like straight because when I do my hair, that's like ponytail, it usually comes out straight. Like I'll get some spots where there's like waves, but after like a while, it will be straight. Especially if I have it in this ponytail for a while. Ooh, see, like I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I'm about to take the soft brush that I wasn't gonna be able to use the hard brush, but yeah. So that was my mini story time on how I was basically mistaken as a porn star. But it's cool. He had gave me free um freaking Nope. Now he's gonna tell his little buddies at work, oh yeah, I went to a porn star's house to install to take out the internet or whatever. And they were like, oh, how is she going to upload her porn now? Like, he's like, oh, no, man. But I'm about to go search her up. And that's going to be so freaking weird. Because I'm not a porn star. So, yeah. This is story time on how I was mistaken as a porn star. When getting my cable taken out out of all things like not even doing anything scandalous just getting my cable taken out like oh you take pictures on the bed huh <laughs> like hmm huh? what but yeah so I'm taking this from the back I'm holding it pretty tight so I can get like make sure everything is like laid down or whatever so I take that and I feel like I should do only like two loops but it's like it depends because I don't like to pull out the back so I just did um, three loops 
instead. And then, um, I don't know what I'm going to wear, but I'm going to take these two scrunchies. This is the uh, um, navy blue and like a burgundy. And I just put them right on top. Actually, I'm going to tease out my ponytail because it's like, I'm going to post this one because I had did a clothing try on and <clears throat> sister's body was not looking great. I was looking rough. Like, that's why I have this waist trainer on because I'm like, damn, sis, you really be looking like that? We're going to do our edges with this. This is the edge booster. Don't you hate when you have so much product on your hand? Like, that's why I take off my ring. So, yeah, I'm just about to do my edges and then, yeah. You can see the final result in the thumbnail and I'll insert a video or something or you'll just see it in the thumbnail but yeah